Hi everybody. All right, so I wanted to do another directed drawing for you today and we're gonna do a butterfly um, because that's what we're starting to learn about. And in the next couple weeks, we'll be doing lots and lots of things about butterflies. But um, what you're gonna need for this drawing is um, something to draw with. So if you wanna use markers, that's fine. I'm gonna use crayons. You can use pencil crayons, markers, crayons, whatever you like. Um, now, the best thing about doing butterflies is that there are so many different kinds of butterflies and so many different colors that they are. So I just chose some colors that I thought, why not? They go well together. So I have yellow and purple, I have a gold crayon, and then I have a couple different blues. But I'm going to start with my black crayon because that's what I'm going to do the outlines with first. Um, and then you're obviously going to need a piece of paper. Um, and just like the last time too, if you want to do your outline in pencil, that might be a good idea. And then if you make a mistake, you can always erase it. Alrighty, so let's get started. Alright, so I've got my crayons here that I'm going to use. I have my blank piece of paper. Um, so feel free to choose whatever colors you like, but you're either going to start with pencil for the outlines, or you're going to start with your black crayon, or marker, or pencil crayon, whatever you have. Um, so first, you're going to start with just a circle at the top. That's going to be the butterfly's head. Then, you're going to draw a body shape in the middle. Um, then we're going to add some detail to these parts. So, um, I'm going to put some little lines in the body. Like that. Doesn't matter, you can add as many lines as you like. We're gonna add eyes and a cute little mouth for our butterfly. And then we're gonna add a cute little antenna. Um, okay, so now we're going to draw the wings. So what you're gonna do is almost draw a little bit of a heart shape on the side. Um, so you start from here. Same thing on the other side. Oops, my crayons sliding up. There we go. There we go. Top two wings. Then you're going to draw the bottom two wings. Um, so you can either start from right up here where the wings are attached to the body, or to make it easier, you can just draw the bottom part of the wing like this. here on the side, makes it a bit easier. Then we're going to add some, because butterflies always have cool patterns on their wings and also lots of pretty colors, right? So I'm gonna add just some little patterns. You can kind of make whatever pattern you like actually on your butterfly's wings. That's what I love about drawing butterflies. But I'm gonna do some circles in here, maybe a bigger circle down here. Butterfly's wings are usually symmetrical though, which means that what you do on one side, you have to do on the other. So if you draw some pretty lines on one side, then you have to draw a pretty line on the other side too. I'm gonna go like that. And then, oh, let's draw some more circles, I think. Draw three circles there, three circles there. We'll draw some, I think I'm gonna do like a, kind of a teardrop shape on this side almost. And then I'll do the same on this side. Like that, there we go. And then we'll do some more circles, three circles on that side, three circles on that side. And we'll do a little line little line. All right, we're almost done making our butterfly. So that means I'm going to choose my other color. Now what color? I think I can do this one for the body. This is my favorite part is coloring in the butterfly. So make sure that after you're done coloring it in and you've finished it all, make sure you send me a picture too so that I can see what colors you decided to use. 
Now, if we were in the classroom right now, we would have our own butterflies that we could look at. Um, and their colors are mostly yellow and orange and red. So if you wanted to do a butterfly with those colors, you definitely could. But just like me, you can also choose to do your own colors for your butterfly that you think are pretty. circles the same because what you do on one side of a butterfly you have to do on the other. I think I'm going to make his wings purple up here. Because why not? Have you guys ever been to the butterfly gardens before? It's really cool in there. They have butterflies but they also have birds and lots of different um, kinds of tropical flowers. Um, but they have butterflies in there that are really small and they have butterflies in there that are really big, like bigger than my hand big, which is kind of crazy to me that in some places in the world, there are butterflies that just fly around, just like we see the little white ones lots of times in um, the spring and in the summer they would see the giant butterflies bigger than their hands just flying around, which is kind of crazy to me. But also really cool how God created all of those different um, species, all those different types of butterflies. Oops, went outside the lines a bit, that's okay. Keep on coloring. done. Maybe I'll challenge you too to see if you can make a different design in the butterfly's wings than I did. You don't have to follow what I do. Um, exactly. You can make your own butterfly look exactly how you want your butterfly to look. So I'm going to make these dark purple on the sides, I think. done yours you get a picture of it and then send it to me so that I can see what your butterfly turned out like and I can also add it to our slideshow all right see you guys later